Hello everyone, Coach Josh Gary here. In this video, I wanted to touch on a question that was sent to me anonymously through email and asking, do professional wrestlers shave their body hair? And if so, why? Yes, a lot of professional wrestlers use one of these, not just on their face, but in other places. And there's several reasons why we do so. Uh, some don't. Uh, some notable ones, Shawn Michaels, Rusev. There are professional wrestlers that don't shave body hair, and there's reasons for it. But I'll get into why professional wrestlers do shave certain body parts and why. Uh, the main thing is, is if you're the body guy, if you are a guy that has a chiseled body and you've got cut and muscles and stuff, you want to show that off. And the best way to show that off is by shaving chest hair, shaving arm hair, shaving back hair, right? To really show off those muscles. Remember, we're professional wrestlers and we're like larger than life. We're not normal. It's almost godlike, right? And so you have to show that uh, essence and being clean cut and, and taking care of your body. And, and you're a professional, right? And you want to look that way. Uh, so the first reason that people shave their body hair is to show off the cut and the contour of the musculature that they have. Now, here's one that a lot of people don't know, forearm hair. The reason that that is shaved off is we all know that black is a slimming color. Well, not everybody has black hair. And you want to show off those striations in your forearms when you're doing headlocks, and arm bars, and things like that. And have you ever noticed that there's wrist tape that people wear? There's a couple of reasons why people wear wrist tape. Mainly it's to, uh, you know, support the wrist, but then it's also to provide grip for things like that because when you start getting sweaty, but also... Your wrist is the smallest part of your body, and we're larger than life, and we want to seem larger than life, and so we put white wrist tape, and it takes away the fact that your wrists are really small, and so then it makes your forearms look really well, uh, larger and more defined. And so if you shave that part, then it looks even better. Now here's the one that has a lot of contention, and I'm a big fan of it, underarms. Guys, shave your underarms, because nothing looks like a backyarder, low rent, I'm not a professional than hairy armpits. It, it just doesn't look right. You look at all the big professional wrestlers, not a lot of them have hairy armpits. There are some that do, uh, but there aren't many. Now, here's the other reason. When body hair gets sweaty, ugh, it stinks. And so think, if your underarm is not shaved and it's hairy and you're sweaty and you put somebody in a headlock, no thank you, bro. I don't want to smell your B.O. while I'm trying to entertain some individuals. Shave it. Please. It'll help. Now, of course, obviously, uh, if you're wearing trunks, the, the thighs, uh, it's gonna, you know, the lower buttocks and, and your hamstrings, you want to shave that because, once again, it's going to show definition. It's going to make you look sleeker. It's going to make you look more powerful. Now, I am going to go ahead and tell you this now. There are tips and tricks on how to do it correctly. Uh, you've got to worry about... Uh, razor burn and stubble and bumps and things like that. Uh, take care of yourself. Look at some of these uh, skincare products, Dove and all these things, so the moisturizer and take care of it because you want to look good as well. Professional wrestling is an aesthetic business. If you look like a professional wrestler, then people will take you seriously as a professional wrestler. If you look like Joe Schmo, who's just doing this on the weekends to get kicks, that's how you're going to be taking, uh, people are going to take you. Right? So you want to look like a professional, you want to act like a professional. And a part of that is you want to look nice outside of the ring, but you also want to look good inside of the ring. Nobody wants the hairy backs and, and things. Now you can do like shave designs into your chest hair if you want to, or kind of trim it up if it's a look that you're really wanting to, like Scott Hall uh, when he was Razor Ramon. If he had a shaved chest, the character wouldn't work, right? Rusev, the Bulgarian brute, you just kind of, that's something that you imagine having chest hair. So if it works with the character and it works with your persona, I'm not saying that you have to shave body hair, but if you're wanting to be that prototypical professional wrestler with the cut, like this guy sitting back here behind me and have that muscular and have it really pop and shine, Go ahead and shave. Yes, it is a lot of upkeep, but anything worth doing is difficult. Once again, guys, if you got any more questions about where you shave and why and hints and tips, leave a comment below. And as always, you can send me messages on all the social media links in the description. You can click over there to subscribe. And of course, you can click over there for any of the past videos that I've done. And my name is Coach Josh Gary. And once again, guys, let's keep driving and striving.